It's a double Emmerdale tonight. A bit of a worrying time for Faith, though. Five years since her double mastectomy. And this evening, her health takes a real turn for the worse. Oh. You all right? Fine! Not like we're in pain. Nothing for you to worry about. Come on, you help me. Maybe I can help you for once. What's wrong? I think you've got enough worries of your own without me bothering you with mine. Right, well, maybe a drink will cheer you up. Oh, only get me in trouble with your brother. You're supposed to be helping her, not getting drunk. No, I'm not drunk. I haven't touched a drop. Yeah. Oh, come on, you've got to believe her. We might, if you weren't so plastered that you can't even stand up straight. Oh, oh well, Sally Dexter, who plays Faith Dingle, joins me now. It's so lovely to see you, Sally. Oh! Thank you, and you. <laughs> it really is. And oh, what a shame because they think that she's she's not. She's in terrible pain. It's I awful. know she is. <laughs> it's so sad. Awful. I mean, why do you think she really is so determined to keep this a secret from the family, the fact that she's so ill? Well, number one, she doesn't want it to be true. And number two, she thinks that it'll worry them. They won't be able to do anything until she knows exactly what's happening. I think she just wants to keep it to herself and pretend it's not happening. Well, she's had it a very, very interesting life. I mean, the Dingles, <laughs> the Dingles are unconventional, I think we can say, but I think, her, yeah, I think her more, more than most even, but you must love playing her. Do you know, she, Lorraine, she cheers me up. Uh, uh, even at uh, my darkest hours, I look at her faith script and I, she just cheers me up and that's what I hope gets passed on to the audience as well. She just cheers me up. Very, yes, very much so. She sometimes looks even dishevelled. You look very glamorous. She does have her own. She does have her own style, doesn't she? I mean, that must really help with the character when you get those costumes on and the hair and everything. I have absolutely no dress sense myself, so it's fantastic to go in and see these incredible clothes lined up on the on the rack. There, it's brilliant. It is good, and the cast are just, you know, we say this a lot, particularly about Emmerdale, but they really yeah. are just like a second family, aren't they? They are lovely, and that's exactly how I would describe them. They are like my second family. Yeah, they're brilliant. And when you had a wee break from Emmerdale, um, you thought you were going to be filming here in the UK. You ended up filming in Mauritius. <sighs> yeah, I just thought I had a few days in Loughborough. I was all packed for Loughborough. I did an I got an extra vest and some socks. <laughs> and then suddenly there was the phone call from the agent saying, Oh, it's like to Japan. <laughs> Go to Mauritius. <laughs> You're going to that's all right, isn't it? This is Prisoners of Paradise that hopefully we're going yeah. to see later on this year or maybe next year. I think so, yes, good, yes. Good, good. yes. Now look, this is so interesting because I remember this uh, programme, Junior Showtime. <gasps> And you were in Junior Showtime when you were a kid. That was like, and that's where Emmerdale's filmed, isn't it? They do it in the same place they film the wall pack scenes. So there's wow. sort of molecules of my 11 year old self in that building <laughs> floating around. It's incredible. <laughs> oh, do you know, I would love it. Sadly, we don't have a clip of you. I wish we did. Can you remember what you performed? I sang, I played my guitar yeah. and sang <laughs> If I Had a Donkey. <laughs> lovely, lovely. Sounds fantastic. And Junior Showtime, I don't, I, I mean, it just it was one of those it? things. Of course, I used to watch it all the time. It was sort of on, sort of tea time-ish. There was Crossroads and then there was Junior Showtime. That's how, that's that's it. how we rocked. That's how it was all about. Now, look, you've had so many awards. You've had an Olivier Award. You've been in so many West End shows. Is that something that you'd like to do again? You know, if you maybe are, are allowed to take a little break from Emmerdale, you can, you know, now that things are opening up a little bit. Listen, Lorraine, I'm up for grabs, anything. I'm, you know, ready to, ready to go, rock and roll. <laughs> good, 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 good. So that's what's going to be. And as well as that, though, you don't, you don't, you don't just act, you're also very creative, I know, because you co-wrote and created Sugar Town, which I oh, loved. Was, Sue Johnson was in that. I mean, you had a great cast that there. Was it was fantastic. fantastic. Sue Johnson, yeah. Is that something that you'd like to do more of as well? More writing, I n not at the moment, not at the moment. My mind's so focused in on on faith and on Emmerdale. I, I, I no, I couldn't. I could certainly couldn't match the writers there. <laughs> Incredible what they do. But it's a really good no. thing. It's a good skill to have. Now, look, what's helped you through lockdown? Because I know that lots of people, you've got a wee puppy. 
Oh my god, we probably Oh we've just gone to mush. Lorraine, oh, we've just oh, gone to mush. Gorgeous. This is Button. Oh Button. How old is Button? Button, button is ten weeks. Eight. <gasps> Beautiful. Yes. What kind of wee dog is Button? He's he is well, apart from being adorable, <laughs> he is a cavapoo. <gasps> I mean, you wouldn't think, because you just got a puppy recently. Well, my daughter did, but I mean, it, it, yeah. everybody would think it was my puppy because I'm always with it. But oh, yeah, we've, well, got, little, we've got little anything. Ruby, and honestly, they're fantastic. They are oh. like wee babies, though. Is Button yeah. sleeping? Is, is oh, little Button sleeping through the night? No. Well, surprisingly, not too bad. There's a little bit of whimpering, right. which is so difficult to resist, isn't it? It's just impossible. No. But he was quite good last night. Um, but have you, are you through the nip nip stage? Oh, nips everything. Slightly... Nips everything. Absolutely everything. Nips Angus. Angus is kind of like um, Angus is great because our dog is really good with Ruby, um, but yeah. just sometimes gets a wee bit fed up and just looks at her, and then she just kind of backs off. And then comes back again. <laughs> but it's, <laughs> it just makes you feel better, doesn't it? They just oh, make you fantastic. feel better. That's the thing. It does. Even when I'm being bitten, and I, I think I'm the Angus in this relationship here. <laughs> I'm getting oh, bitten to bits, but beautiful. oh, I mean, look, we we have just gone puppy brained here. It's it's extraordinary. Enjoy, oh. enjoy, enjoy the most beautiful wee thing, Sally. Great to talk to you. Emmerdale continues Absolutely. tonight, of course, from 7 yes, o'clock. Yes. But you can watch all this week's episodes on the ITV Hub. Beautiful yeah. dog. Oh, so Thank cute. you. <laughs> Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.